earlier today with a real quick unboxing for you guys. So, um, as you can tell from the title, it's a uh, hot sauce making kit. I'm kind of being quiet right now because my, my grandpa's in there upstairs sleeping. My grandma, grandpa, and I don't want to wake them up because my grandpa will get all pissed off. It would make for a funny video, but, you know. Yeah, I'm not trying to do that right now, but as you can see, this is what it contains. That's the site if you guys want to get it. Uh, I don't have any idea how much it was. I got it as a gift from my dad and his girlfriend. But the reason I'm making the video is one, because I want to uh, unbox this stuff in a video, and two, because I'm testing the uh, GoPro, which is what I'm recording with. And as you can tell from my phone, I think you can see that it should be able to see a 1440 30 FPS, so 4K. Um, because you know that's the highest setting you can get to. So let me uh, let's open this cup for up. Trying to just cut out the white. <laughs> yeah. So, white vinegar, apple cider vinegar. Comes with tons of bottles. Spices and dried peppers and shit. And you know the cool thing about this is that if I don't want to use the these two peppers in here, I can go get dried habaneros or ghost peppers or whatever I want and just throw them in here. It's pretty cool. Yeah. So one of the reason I'm making this is because I counted on um, death toll. I don't know if you guys know know what death toll is. If you watch reckless eating. He's on there, but he also has his channel, Death Toast Corner. You guys check it out. I remember I'll put a notation here, and you guys can click it. If not, just search him up. He's a really cool dude. Really interactive with his fans. Um, you know, if I comment on it, he usually responds within a couple hours. He's in California, so and I'm in New York, so time zone differences kind of get difficult. But he always responds when you have a comment on his video, which is really cool. I really like big YouTubers that um, are still interactive with their fans and still comment back, which is cool. But I told him that um, once this is done being made, I'd send him a bottle for free because I want to see him review it and see what he thinks of it. Um, he could love it. He could hate it. It could be the most disgusting hot sauce he ever had in his life. But if he doesn't like it, I wanted to tell him because I want to know how to improve. And I love how wide this camera is, by the way. Okay, the camera is, I don't know, a little bit bigger than a Zippo. About that big. Okay. The lens is about that big. Okay. But you can see my hands that are way over here. Like, my hands are on the side of the camera right now. And you can see my hands. The camera itself can't see it. Like, it's just ridiculous how wide this goddamn camera gets. Which is good and bad. But, anyways, yeah. So, um, Death Toll, I'm going to comment on your video after I'm done making this and this is uploaded and tell you to check it out. So, if you're watching this Death Toll, thanks for watching it. Um, but yeah, once this is done, I'll be sending you a bottle of it. Same thing, um, I'm going to send one to Cartley Lover too, because he also does hot sauce reviews, and maybe I'll send one to their crew at Reckless Eating, but they don't open their fan mail very often. Maybe I'll send them to McJugger Nuggets and McBig Brother too. Who knows? i got to give my one to my dad and his girlfriend, though, because they made me promise that I'd give him one. But yeah, guys, um, let's check out what else they got in this kit. It's got bottle tops and, uh... uh funnel to put the shit in there with, and um, yeah guys that's pretty much it, I just want to make this quick video and mostly as a test to the GoPro, so tell me how this looks in 4K, um, I'm still fucking around with settings right now, ProTune is on, this is shooting in 4K at 30 frames per second, again with ProTune on, 
Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to render this in Sony Vegas or if I'm going to render this in the GoPro Pro um, Studio software. Um, I'll probably try to put that in the description, but I uploaded a ton of um, render tests already, but they're all unlisted because you guys don't need to see them right now. But yeah, alright guys, thumbs up, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you guys next time. Joycon 94 out. Alright guys, I just want to show you real quick how wide this camera actually is and how small it is and how much you can see. Um, this will be at the end of the hot sauce video. This part here is set in 1080p, 60 frames per second. It's going to be rendered out in 4K, I'm pretty sure though. Um, who cares, doesn't matter. I'll talk about that later. Just want to make this quick bit to show you guys how wide the camera is. And I'm going to get a, um, if I don't get it for my birthday, which is January 3rd, I'm going to buy myself um, head strap, chest strap, wrist strap, selfie stick, etc. It's going to get it's basically this kit on Amazon. It's like $30. And it'll have a whole bunch of mount and shit with it. But yeah, that's it, guys. I just want to show you guys how small the camera actually is. And just so you guys can actually see how small it is and how wide you can actually see. I'm sure you can see my hand over here. But you can see how small the camera is. It's crazy. But yeah. Alright guys, see you guys next time.